What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another interview edition of Learn Crypto. My name is Nick Hellman. Today, I have with me Rakan, the VP of Business Development for Eureka NFT Platform, protecting your work, your rights, and your revenue. How are you doing today, Rack? Great, brother. Thanks so much for having me on board. No really problem. appreciate it. Before we get started, guys, make sure to hit that like, share, and subscribe button if you want us to keep putting out this content. So you guys can learn about new projects in the crypto space. We need the followers, the likes, and the subscribes. So this is actually the first video I've ever done for Eureka, even though my community has been with you guys since pre-sale when it was around nine cents. And you guys have done a lot of things since then. But for a lot of uh, the YouTube uh, followers and the Twitter followers, they may know nothing about your project. So can you just give us kind of like a high level overview of what you guys have going on? Yeah, so hang on. This is our first one. First one hey, I've ever done. Hey, man. Well, I'm honored. Really appreciate <laughs> it. <laughs> so, yeah, Nick, thanks a lot for having me on board. I uh, really appreciate the opportunity to talk uh, talk to you about this and, and to your community. It's a big day for us today. This is all, you know, everything we've done is leading up to this day, and then there's going to be more well beyond. So, for those of you, for those of your community or uh, individuals who don't do not know Eureka, we're a, we're a project. Uh, you know, really, we came about to protect, manage, and monetize creative content uh, on the blockchain. Right now, 85% of digital assets out there, creative artists don't get uh, compensated for. So our whole platform really is is to make sure that their their work is validated, it's protected, and that they're able to monetize it because. You've seen a lot of, you know, especially with, with, with uh, crypto the way it is, with NFTs the way they are, amount of different um, um, fraudulent activity happening, people just taking advantage of other people's creative work and trying to make a quick buck for themselves. We're there to try and stomp that out, right? Obviously, it's going to take a lot, a lot, uh, a lot of effort to do it, but like we are really the only platform, the only project out there that is, is doing this in this space with a holistic package of proof, basically a copyright on steroids to be able to protect these, these, these artists. It's, it's awesome. Yeah, that is really interesting. And that's why we got uh, interested in you during the pre-sale because you're seeing more and more copy and paste of NFT art from one chain yeah. to another. And then the original artist doesn't even get any royalties or revenue streams from the copy and paste. Uh, so I think it is a real utility in the space. And especially as we get, as I see NFTs evolving to almost like utility NFTs, maybe they're admission tickets, or maybe they're, uh, you know, VIP memberships or whatever. So it's really important to, like you said, almost have a copyright proof of validation. So the right people are getting the right perks moving forward for the ownership of their art and NFTs. Yeah, Nick, you know, it, it's interesting because um, like I'm new into the, 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 the crypto world. I've only been involved in the last, you know, six, seven months. And I followed crypto before that, and I'm just wondering how the heck people are investing in certain certain projects where there's no business platform, there's no solution to a problem. Right. It's just you know the FOMO, fear of missing out. Someone says something about this this meme coin or whatever, and people jump on board. Whereas you know our our project Eureka, we we have a solid business platform. We are solving a problem, uh, solving providing a solution to a major problem. So. You know, we're so excited about what we're doing. I used to be with KPMG 14 years and, and, and you know, I left the firm after speaking with our, our, uh, our founder, Harsh Kandewal, for 30 minutes, who's actually a buddy of mine. He says, hey, this is what I'm doing. And 30 minutes later, I left my firm right. to jump on board this startup. You know, explain that one to your wife and kids. <laughs> <laughs> it's hard to explain any of this crypto to anybody, let me tell you. But yeah, that is interesting. I think we're starting to get in the market cycle. I've been in crypto since 2016, so I've kind of seen it all. But now I think we're starting to get past just speculation. And we're looking for projects with fundamentals, real revenue streams, because you're going to start seeing traditional businesses, but on the blockchain, using crypto, using tokens. So you need revenue streams and utility of these tokens to provide value back to the investors and the users. And that's something I am seeing with you guys. Now, I did... Yeah, nice. I did hear you mention that today is a big day. You know, we did plan oh, yeah. this a while ago and you're like, well, I can't tell you. We'll plan the day around this announcement. And now today's the day. Got a message from you. So we wanted to hop on here. So what is the biggest news for Eureka that just came out today? Yeah, man. Well, um, uh, I'm pretty sure you guys know that uh, music is becoming really popular in the crypto world. You know, it's becoming very bullish. Um, and people are, are like, even we're, we're signing on, uh, bringing on uh, 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 music publishers and producers, uh, sorry, music producers to, uh, to drop their NFTs. 
We've done work with uh, with Benny the Butcher. We're about to drop Dave East. We've done work with Buda and Grands. We have a number of different uh, individuals, even a guy out of Brazil too. Today, big news, man. We, we announced it. We're getting in the music publishing and men business. All right. Like, it's, it's, this is a big, big thing for us. And not only are we just getting into this, we have aligned ourselves and partnered with Cobalt. Right? Okay. Cobalt is one of the largest music publishing businesses out there, right? Just using their best, their best of uh, breed uh, platform, right? To, to work with, to work with artists, to get their royalties paid out. This is a phenomenal opportunity for us because you know, there are other music publishing uh, businesses out there, but it's a big difference with, with Eureka, right? right. Just, for the, just for the fact that we'll be able to utilize Cobalt technology to get royalties paid out to these emerging artists. That's one thing. Secondly, what we're going to be doing is investing back into these artists as well. And now this is I'm going to tell you about how this is going to impact uh, in our token holders. But, you know, artists right now, they're... They're being, you know, there's a stranglehold on these artists when they when they sign up with, you know, with with labels and everyone's got their hand in their pocket. Mm -hmm. What we're looking at doing is when we sign them on board, we're going to utilize Cobalt's technology. We're going to get their royalties paid out, but at the same time, we're going to invest back into select number of these artists, right? We're going to pay them. We're going to pay them to. Uh, we're going to invest in them, and in return, we're going to take a percentage of the royalties. But the big difference here is that they still retain their their master rights for their music. Like a lot of which us, is unheard of. of, right? No, no. Many of us have friends and know people in the music industry and they're all being taken, you know, everyone's picking, picking apart, you know, taking everything from them as much as they can. Well, here's an opportunity for us to invest back in them. And we're going to invest either dollars or tokens. That's right? awesome. Again. Yeah. Just for a, a percentage of, of the royalties. And with that, if they're going to decide to use, uh, take Eureka tokens, here's something that's really cool they'll be able to take those tokens and stake into one of our pools going forward. So it's more of an investment for them. We're setting up a fund for them. Right. And now at the same time, the, the, the revenue we collect on our investment of the, of the royalties, we're gonna share that back with our token holders. Our token holders are now gonna have the opportunity to invest in musicians. Right. So a couple of things to break down here, guys. A, great idea to get in the music industry, but they're not just creating an idea. They're actually creating a real world partner who already has the connection, who already has the music artists. So now they're just applying it to blockchain. This is something that we all want. We want utility to utilize the blockchain technology. And here's something that they are doing, a traditional company coming to the crypto side. That's number one. Number two, I'm hearing that there's going to be royalties from the success of these music artists, which means that Eureka holders, the token, will then get the, some a pro prorate share of those royalties based on the tier structure that they're in. That's something we can talk about in the future as well. And I'm assuming, I don't know if Eureka, the project is going to choose, or maybe token holders, like a governance will choose like a DAO system on which music artists you really like, which ones you think will be successful and which ones you want to invest in. So the days of investing and being a VC or a pre-sale and speculative tokens, not to say it's over, but here's an op another opportunity to almost get in the pre-sale of an up and coming artist. And if they hit it big, then you're going to hit it big as well. That's what I got from all of that. Am I on the right yeah. track there? You, you, you nailed it, Nick. You nailed it, man. Like, you know, this is phenomenal. Again, it's phenomenal. We, you know, we, we do want to provide the, our token holders, ones that have invested in, in Eureka, ones that have held on to Eureka, the opportunity to be able to be part of this, right? For them to start choosing. Right now we have Scott McCracken, who is, uh, he's, he's leading up our music division. He's the one that helped orchestrate this, uh, this opportunity with Cobalt. You know, and you know, he's he comes from the music industry. He is a he's a um, a manager. He's a musician himself. His his dad, very famous musician um, uh, in in the past, and this is the individual that we are tasking to be able to to launch this platform as well. And we do want to be able to get our community involved, so that they can benefit from this. Like this is, you don't understand how how excited we are about this because like again, everything builds up. And I got I'm gonna say this, you know. We've had a lot of people on our community chat group saying when, 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 right? And it takes time. Everyone, you know, they have, it, it, they want to come in for the pop. But as I mentioned, we're here solving a problem. And it takes a while to solve that problem. But, you know, honestly, we've been around since March. We launched in March of 2021. And we're now, you know, November 2021. So in this time frame to do what we've done, 
is phenomenal. To be able to, to, to partner up with a billion dollar organization that signs right. billion dollar contracts and deals, to have them have their faith in a startup like ourselves. That says a lot. Just, it says it a lot about a lot. Eureka. And, and yeah. not only, guys, this isn't only the first news. You, you know, Eureka already has an active and working NFT platform that they've been taking advantage of. Like you said, you've already had uh, music artists and other individuals and influencers launching NFT drops on your platform that are selling out. So the utility and the use case for your platform already exists. This is just an add-on. And I'm sure there's even more plans in the future as well. Yeah, and, and honestly, Rick, we're, we've, done, we've done a number of partnerships. Um, so we've partnered up with an NFT aggregator called DSpace. <clears throat> we're partnering up with a key storage platform called Zero Chain. We're going multi-chain to be able to, to, to offer our validation services on, on other marketplaces. Um, we're going to be bridging as well incre to increase liquidity. Um, there's, there's so much, right? There's so much we have to offer. And again, I want to thank all of you who are out there who have held our token. And for those that have not uh, invested in, in Eureka, just give you a, an idea and a thought that, hey, man, we're going, we're going places. Right. And you guys are still a relatively an unknown. And the reason I think you're an unknown, obviously you're brand new. You just started. But again, you guys are only on the Ethereum network with really access only on Uniswap, which at current rates is very inaccessible for some smaller investors. But you just yeah. kind of hinted at it. I was going to bring it up later. You guys are already looking at going multi-chain. Multi obviously, everybody loves BSC. It's 16 cents per transaction. Everybody loves Polygon. It's about three cents per transaction. And once you open up these uh, multi-chains, I think it opens up the doors for a lot more users who are either on other chains or have less uh, amount of money at one given time to start participating and being a URQA holder and participating on the Eureka platform. And it opens up the US market right now for us as well, right? Which is a, which is a big, big market. Right. right. And and so there's just, again, yeah, lots to offer. You know, we've been working diligently. We're all, you know, stressed, working, you know, 20 hour days, just trying to make this all happen and just trying to answer to our community and give them what they're looking for. And so, man, I'm telling you, this is this has been a great decision for me to do what I've done for, you know, uh, for the ind other individuals on our team. We hired as well. Here's some news. We hired a new CEO. His name is Kirk Ferguson. You know, he comes from a, a with a with a big marketing background. I told you about Scott McCracken, who is leading our, our music division. We have like the, the depth and the breadth of talent we have right now to lead us forward is tremendous. That is awesome. We've talked about some of the utilities of Eureka, but I think it would be nice to touch base on how people actively start participating in these utilities. I have seen that you guys have a, a tier system, which gives you some benefits. Uh, so if you want to kind of maybe explain that. And then, of course, there is staking pools. I think sometimes you do those in collaboration with Fairm Network and their Unifier wallet. So if you kind of just want to touch base on that so people know, like, hey, why should I buy URQA tokens? Why should I hold Eureka tokens? And how do I really benefit from all this good news? Yeah, Nick, so we have a, we do have a tier system where the top tier is, uh, is uh, 100,000 plus token holders. And it is it levels up, and so the more the more tokens you have, the more ability to to access the utility that we do offer, and that could be you know discounts on NFT sales, percent of royalties of uh, revenue and, and community pot payouts. Um, you know we have vault access to to limited edition NFTs that were that were um, that we have. There's just so much, you know, and then also um, the investment in our music publishing admin platform, the ability there, and this is I think for me is the most exciting one. Um, to be able to, to really invest in an artist, right. invest in someone that you love, that someone that you, that you really feel is going to be, be, be out there. So there's, yeah, there's, there's, a lot, there's a lot of reasons why people should be uh, investing and, and partnering with us. That's really interesting. It almost sounds like Eureka is going to now become a launchpad platform for pre-sales of music artists. So that's really interesting. <laughs> you know, so we have just on the MPA platform, you know, sure, we announced it. That's great. What next? Well, we already have around 20 artists that are lined up ready to sign, uh, sign their agreements uh, to, to come on board. We have a big one, a big one we'll be announcing in the next day or so that uh, is, a, is, a, is a major uh, Canadian artist. Uh, she is uh, she's Stingray's uh, top artist for the, uh, the last two months. She's, I think she reached number 30 already, right, wow. in the charts. So this is, this is a big one, and she is uh, a phenomenal individual that we're so excited and, and happy to be able to, uh, to partner with. Also, with that, in the music industry, I'm not sure if you guys know, but we've signed on board Harvey Mason Jr., who is the CEO of the American, American Recording Academy, 
and also the Grammys as one right. of our major advisors. And That's so he's cool. also backing it. Like think That's about cool. that guy who's done work with everyone, Michael Jackson, Jay-Z, like you, you name it, right? Right. He believes in us. Rub, rubbing elbows with the right crowd. That's for sure. That's oh, crazy. Yeah, man. I so can't what, wait to I can't wait to walk the carpet. <laughs> what's the what's the minimum uh you are keep the Eureka tokens on your tier system? Like what's the minimum to get on the one, bottom tier structure? Yeah, one thousand. So people 1, you get, it sounds like you probably need to get one thousand to a hundred thousand plus Eureka tokens because it sounds like the first music artists they're gonna be bringing on are gonna be the home runs and the ones that you probably want to participate and maybe trying to invest in them or get involved in this uh, new launch pad feature. So, I mean, exciting times for Eureka and Eureka tokens. Um, a lot of utilities, it sounds like you have, you have more and more utilities coming. That's what we look for. I'm more of a fundamental guy. I like business, I like revenue, and then I like payouts back to the holders, almost a crypto version of dividends on steroids compared to the tr traditional markets. And that's what really has staying power in this ecosystem and will be here for years to come. Um, so. Yeah. You know, we've kind of gone over a bunch. Is there really anything else that you want to discuss today pertaining to the platform, to the token holders, anything we might have missed? Yeah, you know, I just, well, first off, there are there are some more, you know, future utilities we're going to offer. You know, soon we'll be able to, you know, token holders will be able to purchase NFTs with their, with their Eureka tokens. We're going to be putting together a preferred access rewards club, you know, access to exclusive items, you know, whether it's like uh, cigars or wine or scotches or, you know, clubs or whatever that uh, we're going to offer to our, our token holders. Um, you know, what I do want to say, though, again, Nick, I just want to reiterate and thank all those who have stayed with us, right? Who, you, you know, we've gone through, we've received some lumps, but man, this is, you know, we're going to, you're going to do that when I'm going through a business. And for those that have stayed with us, we really want to thank you. Stay, continue staying with us. For those who are not on board yet, take a look at our project, look at what we're doing, look at some of the announcements. And if you feel it's a great investment for you, I think it is. If you feel it's a great investment for you, hop on board, man. This thing's going to go up. That's awesome. And guys, look, remember to look in the description below. I'll have their website, their Twitter handle, their contract address to make sure you're getting the right token if it is something that interests you. If you think Uniswap is a little too expensive, I also believe they are in Bittrex International. And he did hint at multi-chain. So hold on, wait for BSC Network, wait for Polygon or another cheaper option to get involved in this platform. Thanks again for coming on here. I really appreciate it. Guys, make sure to hit that like, share, and subscribe button. Thanks for tuning in to Learn Crypto with daily updates for crypto and stock, technical analysis, fundamental analysis, and news. Peace out. Thank you. Thanks, brother. Appreciate it.